Things You Didn't Know You Could Make with Canva, part 37. Add some drama to your designs with this easy split text effect. Start with a block of text and then rotate it just a little bit. I'll put it to about 20 degrees. If you want to get precise with the angle, just click on position and go over to arrange, and then you can put the exact rotation that you would like right down here. So I'll make it negative 20. Next, go to the app section and look for design to image. And we're going to convert this into an image. So click convert to image, select transparent background, and then click export. It will look blank when it's finished, that's okay, and then click Add to Current Page. Take the image and make it the size of your whole page. Duplicate the image and just move it over a bit. Now go up to the ruler and drag down some guidelines. I'll put one there and one here. If you don't see that ruler at the top of your page, go over to File, Settings, and make sure to turn on Show Rulers and Guides. And while you're here, lock the guides so they don't accidentally move while we're working on this design. Now click on the back image, go to edit, and select Duotone. Choose any one of these color choices or create your own, and it will turn that text into a color. Now take that second image and place it directly on top. Drag the bottom handle up to your top guideline. You can see it shows the text behind it. Duplicate this layer, place it directly on top, drag the handle down so it covers again, and then take the top handle and drag that down and it will reveal the text behind it. You now have this top layer, the middle layer, and this bottom layer. Go over to Elements and find a drop shadow that looks like a line. I'll use this one right here and add it to the page. Place that drop shadow up at the guideline. Then duplicate it, select flip, choose flip vertical, and bring this one down to the second guideline. We can clear these guides, so go to File, Settings, and choose Clear Guides. Select all of your layers and group them together. Then go back to position and rotate it back the other way. Your text now looks like it's split with a shadow effect, giving it a little bit of depth. You can also add additional layers simply by adding new colors to each layer. Be sure to follow me for more Canva tips.